Okay, here I go. We're good. Didn't have time. That's good. He's dead. He's dead. Yeah. We killed the Minotaurs. All right. <laughs> that 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 cooperation was a little bit. Uh, we got there. We got there. Uh, hey. Amulet of the Unworthy. Resistance to slashing damage. Vulnerability to bludgeoning damage. I'm gonna give that to Karlak. So resistance it's to slash, but day. more vulnerable to bludgeoning. Better stop to rest soon. Come on, let's go. Don't move too far where there's traps. Ooh, still the ahead. Traps were detonated. There by the might Minotaur. be more ahead. And we don't. We should rest before we take any steps, in my opinion. Okay. Because if you walk a little bit, it accidentally might. trigger a trap. Yeah. That would suck. Um. Fuck yeah. Uh. Can we short rest and be fine, or we can long rest? Uh, probably long rest. Well, we're out of like spells. Yeah, spells exactly. Spells so spells. let's long let's long rest. Yeah. Um. Hello? Well, you've been naughty. And you know what happens when you're naughty. Gods damn it. Anyone but her. Uh huh. Huh? <laughs> Aren't you a luscious thing? Introduce yourself. Sounds like he was forced to. Time to let the Hellcat out of the bag. Call me Mazora. I'm Will's patron, the fount of his power. My pet's been unruly, and his leash needs a yank. Oh, what a sub. Oh no. We had a deal, Will. But Karlak's still breathing. I've taken more pleasant shits than you, Mizora. <laughs> at least those can be buried after. That's no kind of talk for a lady. By the way, Karlak, Zariel sends her regards. You told me! Devils only! She's a tiefling, not a monster! How precious. The little pupster's found his bark. Clause G, Section 9. Target shall be limited to the infernal, the demonic, the heartless, and the soulless. Karlak meets the criteria by virtue of having no heart. <laughs> okay. Bureaucratic. Target shall be limited to the infernal, the demonic, the heartless, and the soulless. <laughs> and because she has the infernal engine. Wow. Yeah, okay. Sure. Sure. Contractual about our our our, mm -hmm. our demon shit. Um uh-huh. So yeah, Will was like bound from from talking about it, right? Um if we kill Carl like that, we'll like get rid of you. Don't you worry. That ship has long sailed the sticks. But a defiant pup must still pay his price. To wit. Oil burns in the fires of Avernus. Don't spank him the in front of us. Of strike his flesh. Let her cook. His soul passes through each layer of the hells. We'll never see him the same way again. And their torment. Oh! Oh shit! You made him cool! <laughs> oh no! 
That's better. <laughs> what the hells have you done? The promise broken, a price paid. You know the terms. Mm -hmm. Get used to the new form, pet. There's no going back. Some magic even I can't undo. Now, let's see how the frontiers fare without their precious blade. Karlak, keep an eye on him, would you? I'll be keeping mine on you. Oh, and Will, don't forget, our pact still stands. Ta-ta. All right, devil lady. Your punishment is an, a legendary epic skin. <laughs> oh no, the Blade of the F Frontiers is defeated. Well, look, as far as I'm concerned, now that's just like one more for the fucking horny party. <laughs> like We are a party of horned ass people. Will, <laughs> I mean, I guess it's hard for him to talk about everyone who's cooler than him. Right? Everyone's got horns. It's great. Sick. Even my little shaved nubs. Uh, you know what? Here, let me use the bathroom real quick. And then we'll... catch up and figure out what's going on over here. And, uh, I want to remind myself to... uh, decide what to do with that amulet we just picked up. As well as sort out the junk. Sounds like a plan. BRB. Alright. Mizora. Devil woman has given Will some horns and then went, bad boy, spank, spank. And that's embarrassing. So we should feel bad for Will because his horns have been exposed on stream for everybody. Will is like, why is everyone so I'm nice to me soldier. now? <laughs> I'm reeling. Will hardly knows me, but he chose my life over his. <sighs> been a long time since someone stuck their neck out for me like that. Yeah, now that he's got horns, he can, uh, he knows the struggle. Yeah, he's good. The best. I mean, a big relax. <laughs> relax on that. <laughs> but he's pretty good. Gobsmacked, really. But grateful. Really grateful. I could learn a thing or two from a man like that. Hopefully we won't turn into Mind Flayers first. Yeah, he's pretty cool. He's alright. Hey, <laughs> you know. Um. Oh, so many questions. A lot of good questions. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Uh... I would like to hear how you ended up fighting in the Blood War. Why not? Let me see if I can paint you a picture. No, this the is year, a story. Ten air. The place? A sleepy little town called Baldur's Gate. Our hero, Karlak, a knock-kneed delinquent from the outer city, with everything to give and nothing to lose. What a nerd knock-kneed. Fill my days and make some cash when I fell into the wrong crowd. Worked for a guy I respected. A lot. Turns out the feeling wasn't mutual. Through the jigs and the reels, he made a deal with Zariel behind my back. You know Zariel, right? Archdevil of Avernus. She put this thing in my chest and set me to work. Well, to war. I learned quick how to stay alive. And the engine served me when it came to killing devils. Ten years of that. The stories I could tell. I mean, self-proclaimed nerd for setting it up that way, right? Knock need and all. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Just a kid from Dayton who had two bad knees and a dream to become a baseball star. <laughs> Thank God this dream came true. <sighs> hey, okay. Um, let me get that name again. Um, which name? Zariel. So, uh, yeah, Zariel, and I didn't say the name of the, uh, nope. of the guy I respected. Okay. 
so we don't know who did it. But you have a chance to ask. Yeah. Guy named Gortash. Politician. Inventor. One of these wheeler dealer types who seems to have a finger in every pie. I guess I was naive to think everything he got up to was above board. What did I know? I saw a job. A good job. With people I liked. Doing work I was good at. Sounds like an orcish name. Sometimes I'm jealous of that girl. Oh, to feel so invincible again. Yeah, but when you're feeling all invincible, that's you're just waiting to fall, right? That's the problem with, with you know, not knowing the limitations. It's, it's, it's good when you when you learn something or two. Uh, what does the engine do? Gives me energy. Power. But you've seen it in action. Very hard to control. If I'm excited at all, angry, nervous, delighted, enticed, I burn hot. Hot enough to burn anyone who gets close. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and when you pop a, a soul coin, then we go triple time. I try not to think about it. I still think about it constantly, but, you know, I try. Mm -hmm. One of these days, I'll sort the whole infernal affair out, mm -hmm. get myself cooled off, start making up for lost time. But, not today. Soldier. Okay. Pent up. <laughs> Don't say it like that. Uh-huh. Yeah, just gotta, you know, gotta knock a few... Bolts loose, <laughs> you know. <laughs> uh, all Bolt right. knocking, you say. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, there was that Smith. Well, now, maybe I could make his acquaintance. A Titan screw or two might let me keep a little calmer. Maybe even manage a pat or bump without burning someone to death. It's been a long time. A pat, a pat or, a or a bump. bump. <laughs> Okay, and we took care of those paladins, and you sh fucking you got that house real good. So. First things first. I need to get this. I'll eat your brains. Up. Things powerful, but it's been feeling volatile ever since I left the hells. Can't be too hard to find an infernal mechanic ground here, right? Yeah, I know a guy. We just said that. All right, and her. We were both part of Zariel's inner circle. Her by choice, me by force. In the grand scheme of things, I'm inconsequential to Zariel. Sure, I've got the engine, but I wasn't even her strongest fighter. But she favored me like a child favors a captive pet. Mizora envied the attention, mm. I suppose. I'm sure when Zariel gave her the order to hunt me down, Mizora was delighted. There's all there's 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 levels to this Satan shit, huh? There's half Satans and full Satans, and there's the ones with the wings, and then the ones that can flash in and and quote poetry and literally put a tempting fucking goblet next to you. So many, so many Satans. CTO, CEO. <laughs> the entire C suite. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. Alright. No kidding. The fighting, the chaos, the betrayal. It had the makings of a good stage show, but I did not want to be one of the players. Mm -hmm. I don't know. You'd think she'd have more important things to do. Devils and their pride. Okay. Good chat. Good chat. Learned a little bit more. All right. Uh, who else? Uh, I mean, you can go consolidate your end as well. And I can go May find darkness protect you. Will. Oh, thank you. Um. <laughs> seems like the same. 
do you have something to say this time? I told you already. All right, never mind. It's I'm out. None up. of your concern. <laughs> some some other day, right? Yeah, keep working on it. Just fine. Chip chip What's chip away. Let dinosaurs come out to play. I don't think I've ever had a confidant quite like you. And if I have, I can't remember them. It's the same. I can't remember. Turn to other matters. I'm out. There you go. Nice chatting. Nice chatting. Nice chatting. Just slowly, delicately, <laughs> fucking using. The, 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 the thinnest, wafer-thin amounts of riz <laughs> every, every day. There's a magic mirror here. Uh, there is. And so the magic mirror is um, apparently something that changes location depending on where you go to camp. And you can use it to change your uh, appearance. I see. So if you want to go back to the creator character, you can do so. Well, I look perfect already, so. Damn. Well, I had to tweak myself a couple times, so let's... We're not all perfect, then. That was good for you, though. We'll, uh, we'll have something to say. What's this all about? You want to talk to him? Sure. Wither is looking good. New moisturizer? To the hells. Just look at me. I did what was right, and Mazora made me pay for it. I'd be hunting devils and demons, she said. Traitors and hypocrites, heartless evils of all sorts, but not... Not Zariel's victims. Not innocent tieflings. Warlock packs tend to be unforgiving from what you know of them. Will was lucky he didn't face a more severe punishment. Yeah. Also, you, all, you're all doubly lucky that you didn't actually fucking... take out... best girl. Um... Did you take out other people that were not deserving in your way mm. to hear? What I'm doing about Raphael, but a pack to Mazzara. What a fraud. <laughs> Damn. The Blade of the Frontiers has some splaining to do. Fraud detected. <laughs> what did you expect? She's a devil. Hardly a paragon of honesty. Between the devil and appropriate punishment, I'd say. Lucky she didn't take a soul when she came. I mean... This sounds mean, but it's kind of what I want to say, you know, with sincerity, to be honest. Um, these are pretty, like, here, these are meaner. These are directly confrontational, right? This is like, yo, what the fuck? You're a fraud. You have some explaining to do. This is actually probably the nicest, if anything. So, yeah. I'd count my lucky stars for it, but I reckon luck is on holiday. I'm only alive because my patron still has use for me. It's Mazora who grants me the power to conjure armor and cast Eldritch Blasts. Before I was infected, I could even call hell beasts and summon festering clouds. But I promise you, every thrust of my blade and every flame I sparked was for the good of the coast. Right. Uh-huh. We can change your job if you want, bro. If you don't want to be you know, Eldritch Blasting anymore. That's doable. Um, every, every corpse was in the name of justice, I hope. Uh, can you discuss the terms? I can't utter the terms or circumstances of the pact. I can tell you most all else, but the pact, I'm forbidden. Unless Mazora permits it. But I'll say this. She did say the section. The moment I pacted myself to Mazora, I have not regretted for a heartbeat. It was my proudest deed. It was worth the sacrifice. All I can give you on that is my solemn word. Hmm. Do you think it was made in that moment when he he became the hero? When he when he heard the cries of the innocent oh. and, he, and he ran in to oh, save them? Spawn with an offer. Connect. He sees the burning embers of Joaquin's rest. And Floric space as she tells you of Raven Guard's abduction. Hells. Older Raven Guard's been taken. Uh yeah, okay, that was the uh the fire. Like mm -hmm. in that 1991 movie Backdraft. <laughs> Just like the 1991 film Backdraft. <laughs> Thank you. Good reference, Reggie. Solid pull. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I didn't know. <laughs> Then 
we need to seek him out and get him to safety. You see... Oh! Grand Duke Raven Guard is my father. Oh. I know I haven't said. Our relation was no matter of pride, not least for him. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. Uh... Okay, if you, I feel like every single time someone gives you a piece of information about themselves, you can be a humongous shit yep. and be like, when were you going to tell yeah. me? When did I know this? <laughs> well, time, you see, is a chronological continuum, which means that not all information can be instantly transmitted yep. the moment you meet somebody. So the concept of a conversation needs to occur. <laughs> hmm. Uh-huh. Baldurian. Heard a son of the city. I didn't even know her children. Yeah, uh, let's uh, let's role play a little bit. Just the one. Yours truly. My father and I were close once upon a time, until he disowned me and cast me out of Baldur's Gate. I can't tell you more. The pact forbids it. Even that. My lips are quite literally sealed. Okay. Come on. He okay. Made me an exile. That said, I'm not about to let him suffer at the hands of his captors. Okay, so then it has to do with that relationship more than the other thing that we were thinking. So anytime he doesn't want to talk, he's just going to be like, The Pact! Yeah, The, the Pact! pact. Uh, oh, you know, yeah. <laughs> Bro, did you steal the last slice? <laughs> oh, oh, the Pact the forbids pack. <laughs> me from discussing such matters, but the Blade of the Frontiers would surely never do anything that was untoward. <laughs> Um, yeah. All right. If it has to do with that, maybe it was like, and, he, and he's like standing by it. Maybe it was like, you know, um, something to be like, uh, maybe, something, maybe it's like something to like protect his mom or something, you yeah. know? If, if it's, if there's, if there's some tension with that there. Um, okay. What do you think the drama wants with him? I've been asking myself the same question. What makes a Duke of Baldur's Gate so interesting to the drow? Even the houses of Menzo Baranzen would have little use for my father. No, this is no drow plot. These absolute nutters, these true souls are behind his abduction. His absence alone will sow chaos in the city. If they were to infect him, he could lead Baldur's Gate to ruin. All the more reason to find him. The Absolute has seized not just my father, but the future uh, of the Salt Coast. Can't let that, him, don't let him turn. Fun. We call them Absonutters for short. <laughs> I'm all for it. Well, yeah. How about them horns? It's said that anyone who bathes in the river of blood emerges as one born anew. It's a lot like that, I imagine. I feel the weight of these pawns on my head, curling upwards like a mammoth's tusks. I feel these ridges snaking down my neck. Not to mention a few bumps and prongs in unmentionable places. But I haven't seen my reflection. I see. Yet. Be my mirror. What do you see? Getting a little getting a little ribbed up. Hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Overly flattering. Overly mean. A hero. I have no idea. Sure, man. You're still the blade of the frontiers. Right down the middle. It's because you know the heart lurking under the horns. The people will see a curiosity. Maybe even a beast hungry for their souls. But I will slay their monsters. Keep them safe. And one day they will see the Blade of Frontiers again. <laughs> All right, buddy. Nerd. Just make sure that they're actually, you know, not victims too. <laughs> that's that's fine. Yeah. After after that close call with uh, Gail the other day, I'm like, yeah, let's let's be nice, but let's not be too nice. You never know. <laughs> um, but the horns are cool. You know, I I like uh, particularly the look of my shaved horns down. You know, I don't want them completely gone. I just want the little bump sticking out like Hellboy. That's just dope. 
You should get out of this pact. A possibility that's kept me awake countless nights. But I don't have a clue where to start, other than play her games and play by the rules. That's the only language devils listen to. NDAs are not really legally binding. Can, oh, is that how it works? You can challenge that shit in court. Uh -huh. You can. Depending on the application of it, it might, and, you know, the court might throw it out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Given you horns, what can she do that's worse than she already has? Can we just attack her the next time she pops up? Yeah. I mean, she can just pop up and do things, though. That's, you know, not to mention if, if she's... I don't know if Zariel is a power source for her or not, but what about a loophole? It could well be. She has the blighted thing. What I know of it is simply what has engraved itself upon my memory. My contract is very clear. I can bring Mazora no harm. She'll have to let me out of my pact willingly. The only okay. way out is if I can out-bargain her. We're standing here with nothing but the clothes on our backs and the worms in our heads. <laughs> well, let's put our worms together. Ooh. We can. I'm sure of it. How glad I am that you see me as more than my patron's pet. I mean, that's... <laughs> you stepped up to patron's pet, like... Well, man. Let's be honest here. <laughs> you know. Like, she literally shows up and goes... Yeah. <laughs> Not so enchanting as you'd think. The... Poor tears, the Caldwells. They were the blue bloods hosting the fancy balls and drinking from gold goblets. Fathers, the son of a blacksmith, born with barely a coin in the coffers. He made a name for himself among the flaming fist. Brave as Balderan, stubborn as a deep rofe. Daring, outspoken, but hardly posh. <laughs> I spent more time dueling with father than I did rubbing elbows with lords. Not to say I didn't develop a taste for good wine and the talent for courtly dance. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I mean, look, I I kind of do want to see a demonstration, but oh, not if it's show you. But that'll be, but they're not an intimate demonstration. Oh, he's gonna show you, yeah, show can you. I? Can we just sit and watch you fucking, you know, just sea walk all around the campfire and see what's up? I guess not. Yeah, that, that's a clear flirt. There's no way to avoid that. All right, wine's good. Here, here. Though, truth be told, I'd sooner down a weak old hooch at a ramshackle inn. Better company, and a better buzz. Okay. Good talking to you. All right. You want to check in? Uh, with? I don't know, Lazelle or so? She's around somewhere, ain't she? Definitely. Ribbiting about. Croaking in a corner somewhere. <laughs> right here. Speak. Or did I have the relationship? I think you did. Oh. Okay. How are you? You hungry? You fed? How can I help? Uh... How do I check in on when you need it? Do we just have to wait for you to bug us? Think of it as... Tribute. The kind a king might pay to a more powerful neighbor to avoid invasion. As long as I pay, there will be peace. But should I ever stop, along comes a war. I can assure you, mm -hmm. the battlefield would extend well right, beyond the right, borders right, of my right. body alone. Okay, I'll wait for you to tell us then before we fucking throw out anything that might be cool. Uh, where's Froppy? Over here? Here. Oh, yeah, let me just see this real quick. Sorry. So, 
apparently there's... This is a, uh... This isn't gonna play for YouTube necessarily. Apologies about that. But, like, the integration with Twitch. So what does this do exactly? It allows you to see our build as we play. Is that how this works? Oh, I didn't know that. Or something. I know people can vote for our dialogue options, but I don't know what else it can do. Um... I just want to quickly check out how this looks. Because I haven't actually seen it. Uh... So is it, it's not over the chat, it's over the screen itself. Okay. Uh, hopefully this doesn't affect our uh, performance. Um, do you mind? Uh, yeah, okay, check. Uh, okay, hold on, let me see something. Okay. Uh, I'm not seeing it at a glance. I'll have to check this out later then. Alright. Seems like it's not popping up. Um, okay, so. Speak. Nope. So quiet. No dice. Rip it later then. <laughs> In inventory we picked up a uh, necklace where was it scam her straight back to the hells just look at me i I'd, I'd be hunting devils yes. and demons not zariel's victims not innocent tieflings Oh, cool. There it is. I see. I bear the image of one at least, but my heart is the same. It's Mazora who grants me the power to... Before I was infected, I... But I promise you, every thrust mm -hmm. of my blade and every flame I spark... Well, that's neat. Yeah. Okay. You can just see our builds and characters and stuff. Okay. Cool. Um, alright, so this thing is resistance to slashing damage and vulnerability to bludgeoning. Is that worth it? That might not be worth it. That seems pretty risky. I don't know. Um, I'd rather just stay like you have to, like, see what is, like, the area and then equip it Situational, right? right? The yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, depends on what you're fighting against. That might come back to bite you in the ass real quick if you forget you're wearing it. Um, hmm. Okay. So. Let's, uh, maybe not put that on you just yet. Because I feel like... You know, random monster is gonna come swinging a, a club at us more than necessarily the, the you know a sword, but you never know. All right, so forget that then. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Okay, I think we checked in with everybody. Shovel, that's useful. Book, bone. Oh, yeah, the sorting. Indeed, indeed. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do this off camera. It'll it'll take too long otherwise. It, it took a while last time, too. Um, but for selling stuff, though, we can definitely do that next time we come across a uh, person who was willing to buy. And I guess that necklace. We'll probably keep that back for Gale. Uh, how's my weight load? I'm pretty good on weight. Sure. I'm pretty high up. Like, uh... 
You're still sorting? I'm at 96.6 out of 120. Okay. Uh, yeah. What are you holding that's for heavy? Did you pick up an accidental barrel or something? Um... I mean, not... Maybe... I have a peculiar chest code. <laughs> What's in it? You picked up... You picked up a, a whole yep, chest. a whole chest. In um, fact, that's the chest that has... The bonus option... The bonus, um... Items for the player characters in them. So there was a bunch of those at the beginning. That were over by the camp, uh... Top side over so there. I'm gonna drop this. Uh, probably don't need that. Now, I did put... Some chests that were temporary replacements for a bag in my inventory, just because I wanted like to hold some items and okay, yeah. their folders. Um, so if you're close, if you're too close to your limit, then yeah, you could definitely drop that off. But uh, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm waiting to get some more pouches and packs that I can use instead of these chests. And I want to sell this stuff, so I have to keep it on me. Yeah, I had stuff marked as wares that I wanted to sell. So yeah, I have a miscellaneous, I have clothing, uh, poisons. Hey, what's up, the Normies TV? Thank you very much for the raid. Much appreciated. Welcome. We are baldering. Um... If you do, if you come across any sacks or things I can use as a folder, yeah. Okay, well, well here we got one burlap sack, so that's perfect. That's that's ideal for separating all these different groups and stuff. But yeah, that's that's kind of what I've been using the chests for. Okay. Uh, full rest. Am I crazy, or was there a button that just went straight to full rest? You have to press Y first, and then no. No, 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 no. Do we not have... Oh, was it auto-select that you do? Auto-select, that's what it is, yeah, okay. It should just be partial rest, full rest buttons, that would be the way. Okay, there we go. Uh, full rest, yes, there we go, alright. Alright, who's doing what? Who's being weird? No Number apnea. One. No CPAP. All right, everybody slept. Nice. We Gucci. Uh, our traveler's chest floating. <laughs> yeah. Magi. <laughs> All right, leave camp. Don't worry about it. Oh. Oh, level up. Or something. New, no, we new, just talked to her. New things to Is say. It, there's something I've been wanting to share with you. It, now's a good time. Uh huh. Well, if you're not gonna do it at camp, right? Might as well. I'm all ears. Voluntarily telling me about yourself. Are you feeling unwell? <laughs> Is it the tadpole? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, are you okay? Are you sick? No. The opposite. I feel like I can share this with you. I've never felt that way before. It's difficult to put into words. I think it might be easier to just show you. Here's the tadpole. The connection. Oh, shit. Come into my mind. Real revelations. Revelatons, even. Are you sure this is what you want? I'm sure. I trust you. I trust you too, Shart. Will you gain a hatred and fear of wolves, too? <laughs> oh, wait, should I ask what I'm going to see? Yeah, what, what what am I going to see? How I came to be who I am. How I found my way to Lady Shah's embrace. Okay. That's fair. Wolves, religion, child abuse... Let's uh, dumping kids in the forest. Let's make our let's dock our parasites together. Okay, we can space dock. I don't remember how it started. Only how it ended. 
I was fleeing. <laughs> oh, young with the Chun Li buns and a scar. It's like that cutscene from the new Tomb Raider. But it looks like a cool wolf. Okay, wait, he's mad. My name. I can't remember what I said. I can't remember anything before those woods. All I know is she saved my life and gave me a new home with Lady Shah. <laughs> it hurts. That's all I remember. Something sparks in your memory about Salunite rites of passage. You heard once about how they would send their children out into the wilds to navigate their way home. Quick, release the wolf so that we can then kill it and have her buy in forever. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Wonders were dedicated to Shara. You feel like you owe your life to her. You look like you're wearing a moonstone. Is that commonly worn by Selenites? Thank you for sharing that with me. I know it can't have been easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Isn't that worn by Selenites? <laughs> you're reading too much into things. A childhood bauble, that's all. Just because Selenites claim something doesn't mean they own it. Which is why she fucking hated that statue and wanted to get away back at the windmill. And it was like, ah, get out of here. I was like, what is that? She's like, nothing. Shut up. Who's what? You, <laughs> me, you, what? Don't mess with that. Yeah. You feel like you're horror life to her. Lady Shaw. But yes, her and those who saved me and taught me her ways. The Mother Superior. She made me who I am. At least as best as I can remember. Mm-hmm. She taught me, trained me, punished me when I failed her, which was often. <laughs> uh, uh, I mean, that doesn't sound great. It sounds like you've had a rough time with her. <laughs> Abuse. Nonsense. The Mother Superior made me strong uh -huh. for the Dark Lady. Right, so you are, so, you know, the, 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 the race from birth in the Salunite way. Can you right? dance? <laughs> How good are your steps? Like, you raised, raised, and raised, and, and born and bred in this way, and then the cool kids at the back of the class jump in and, and saved you from that bully one time. And then they're like, here, why don't you come hang out with us? Put on these Jenko jeans and mm -hmm. yeah, you know start start wearing these leather jackets and before you know it you're one of us and then don't worry about it we'll just have to do some initiation if you really want to be part of the cool kids right I like how you can literally say sounds like abuse that's that's great <laughs> <laughs> that's that's fantastic wow. Okay. Hey, how y'all doing? You two. You two doing good? Everything good? All good. Everything cool and crips? 